What's that? <laughs> Good evening, CoreySchmager.com. This is Corey Schmager telling you about the negative effect of soda. Nice. So, the first thing you should see or think about when you see a soda bottle is a high fructose corn, high fructose corn syrup. Drinking high fructose corn syrup, the main ingredient in most soft drinks around the world, increases your triglyceride levels and also your bad cholesterol, the LDL. It's metabolized into fat more rapidly than any other sugar. High fructose corn syrup has been directly linked to diabetes, obesity, and metabolic syndrome. The next thing you should think about is the very high phosphorus and the absolute zero calcium. When phosphate levels are high and calcium levels are low, the calcium is pulled out of the bones, which causes your bones to become brittle, fragile, and break, which is why you see all those guys pounding Mountain Dews and riding their dirt bikes breaking the bones. Each soda has a substantial amount of phosphoric acid, and in an experiment, human teeth were put in a cup of cola and they actually started to dissolve. Not good to think about. Aspartame is known as Equal, Splenda, and it has other artificial sweeteners. Used in all diet sodas, aspartame is broken down into methanol, which is directly ingested into the bloodstream. It's about 20 milligrams of methanol per soda, which breaks down into about 6 milligrams of formaldehyde. Those of you who are not familiar with formaldehyde, let me just tell you, it is absolutely toxic, not what you want in your body, and absolutely not what you think of when you talk about what you're putting into your stomach. 6 milligrams of formaldehyde is 30 times the daily EPA limit in New Jersey, 100 times the limit in California, and 3 hundred times the limit in Maryland. I, I, do you guys realize that when you're putting soda in your body, that you are putting formaldehyde in your stomach? What? Moving on. Obesity is also direct, directly related to soda. Research has calculated that for each additional soda consumed, the risk of obesity increases by 1.6 times. One soft drink a day gives children a 60% greater chance of becoming obese. Facts have shown in studies that schools have actually decreased their milk purchases by 30% in the last 20 years and have greatly increased their soda purchases so kids these days are drinking this stuff like they used to drink milk. Each daily drink adds 0.18 points to a child's body mass index. In summary, next time you see a soda bottle, remember, you don't want high fructose corn syrup, you don't want high phosphoric acid, and you don't want your bones breaking because you have low calcium, you don't want, aspart you don't want aspartame because it breaks down into formaldehyde, which we have explained is extremely toxic, and you also don't want to be obese because you want to be healthy and active. So, this is Corey Schumacher saying, stay healthy everyone, and follow me on Twitter, Corey Shu, C-O-R-Y-S-H-U.